Okay, here's a quick video to show you something that I'm working on. So as you can see, I've got a leather glove on. Now, the reason I've got a glove on is because I'm going to show you something that I've been, you know, toying around with the idea of, which is basically a contactless payment glove because winter's coming in. So when you go to shops, you know, you really don't want to have to take off your gloves to find your wallet, to find your purse, to go through your bag and stuff like that. So what I'm doing is creating a, basically an NFC you know, contactless payment glove that you can just basically tap on a card reader and make a payment. So right now what we're going to do is we're going to do a test purchase. So if we just click test glove contactless payment just here, you'll see that it's going to charge one pound on the actual terminal. It should say one pound on the screen. I'm not sure if you can see it, but right now we're going to basically try and do this. So it's going to be a bit awkward because I'm trying to film and I need to basically put my hand on the back of, you know, the back of my hand onto the terminal. And because I can't see the back of the terminal, um, you know, it's going to be a bit of guesswork. But basically, we're going to see if we can get this payment to go through and do a live demonstration. So let's hit charge. And it's now asking us for an NFC device. So let's try the glove out. And it's just gone through. It's just processed that beautifully. So as you can see, contactless payment with a glove. And this is something that I'm working on because we're coming into, you know, basically autumn. Weather's going to get colder. And, you know, like I say, you don't really want to have to take off your gloves to find your purse, to find your wallet, to find your money in your bag, in your pocket. And that's why I'm working on this. And as you can see from that test demonstration, it just went through beautifully. So thanks for checking out this video. If you want to know more, then just drop me a message.